Siku ya jana tarehe 12 mwezi wa tano mwaka 2021 kulitokea habari hapa Kenya kwenye mitandao ya kijamii kuhusu mcheshi Ahamo. Na kulingana na habari hii ilikuwa inasemekana kwamba mcheshi huyo aliachishwa kazi na kampuni iliyokuwa imemwajiri kampuni ya Royal Media Service. Na kulingana habari hii ilisemekana kwamba mcheshi huyo aliachishwa kazi kwa sababu hajakuwa kienda ofisini for the past one month. Lakini kumbe vitu ni tofauti na vile habari hii ilivyosema kule nje kwenye mitandao ya kijamii. Now it has come to our attention that Professor Hamo mwenyewe yeye ndio aliamua kuacha kazi. Na ini baada ya ile memo ambayo uh, kampuni hii ya Citizen TV iliandikia waajiri wa wao wote including the staff member as long as you are under the Royal Media Service uh, umbrella. Na hii ni mema ambayo iliwaonya wafanyikazi wa Royal Media Service kujihusisha kwa side hustles fulani. Na hapo ndipo Professor Hamoa ka film kama anajaribu kukaziwa maisha. Kumbuka kwamba huyu ni mcheshi. He is a content creator and most of the time kuna kampuni tofauti ambazo humpatia deals za advertisement huku na kule. Na Royal Media Service ikasema kwamba kama unafanya kazi na wao, haufai kujihusisha kwenye advertisements fulani uh, unless umepata approval from your bosses from the company. Na hii ni memo ambayo imeenea sana kwenye mitandao ya kijamii. Wacha ni kuonyesha hapa. Unaona hiyo memo imeandikwa Addendum 1 the Royal Media Code of Conduct guidelines on external use of Royal Media services talents na pale imeandikwa kwa hivi where as the management appreciates the individual brands of the Royal Media service talents the use and deployment of such talent whether in person or corporate activities greatly affects and influence their overall brand of the company These guidelines endeavor to facilitate and promote the effective and proper use of all talents and staffs within the Royal Media Service brand umbrella and also protect Royal Media Service reputation and brand. These guidelines apply to staff in all Royal Media Service products and station and should be read in conjunction with any applicable policy. The guidelines should be applied in the spirit as well as the letter. That means that common sense should be applied, a strict legal interpretation should not be used to justify accepting an advertiser or sponsor which the guidelines intended to stop. Similarly, an unreasonable interpretation should not be used to prohibit something which is clearly in line with the intention of the guidelines. The guidelines apply to any staff seeking to take part in any advertisement i.e. outdoor flyers, radio, televisions and or digital platforms or in any event as a master of ceremony, panelist, host or contributor. Well, hapa sasa inawahusu watu wote ambao kwa chini ya Royal Media Service. Kama unataka kuonekana kwenye advertisement maybe kwa runinga eh, kwenye radio kwa flyers a digital platform this means on social media pages yani all these people are now being watched by this company na hiyo memo ikaendelea kusema hivi staff are prohibited from taking part in, in the following but not limited to categories of advertising A advertising for faith religion and equivalent system of belief B advertising for alcohol products and advertising for political parties and or their candidates we sasa hapa ndio hapo inasemekana kwamba professor hamon kama kaona hii memo i make sense kwake kwa sababu yeye ni content creator and now this means he cannot be allowed to to advertise for other brands through his social media pages Uh, just because he is employed by Royal Media Service. So in Simekano Kamba, this is the main reason why Professor Hamo decided to leave Royal Media Service kwa sababu ni kama alikuwa anakaziwa maisha. How can you be working for a company na alafu anaku prohibit kujihusisha na kazi zako kule nje? So you are not supposed to advertise for another product, eh? You are not supposed to be involved in any uh, event as an MC, maybe as a panelist hizo zote mwambie amufai kufanya mnafaa kusika approval from your bosses man this is quite strange watu wanasema this is just uh, yani wamekuwa ni kama ma dictator 
and probably this might be the cause of other people leaving the royal media service uh, company kwa sababu kuna watu wengi wanafanya kazi kule now wamesema all the radio stations as long as wanna fanya kazi kwenye royal media service this including their all radio stations from radio citizen in oro ramogi all these people now wameambiwa <laughs> kuna kufanya advertisement kule nje um, without seeking approval now if i could, could defend in any way so, man this is quite strange man anyway mwenyenyu ni gani twacheni mwenyenyu kwenye comment section tuambie thank you for watching let's me next time bye bye